guys. This is Lea and today I have something very exciting. Look at this. <laughs> so um, it's almost been a month since I had my Taobao order shipped and it finally arrived today. It was supposed to arrive yesterday but sadly I wasn't home but then I woke up to mor uh, this morning at 5 like being all paranoid that the bell was ringing and that my package is here and then I realized it's 5 of course nothing's here so I fell asleep, woke up at 7, I couldn't fall back asleep and now at around 4 it finally arrived so I've been like waiting all day so I'm just gonna dig in and show you what I got because I'm extremely excited I even got some hair stuff. I got tiny little curly irons that I cannot wait to show you. So I don't remember if Emmy actually mentioned this in her video. We had a bit of trouble getting our stuff actually sent. Or I did have trouble because we ordered everything through Emmy's card, which has her address, of course, on it. So like. When we paid shipping as well, I just used her PayPal account, which had her address. And they were just like, no, the addresses don't match. It do like, you cannot ship it to a different address because it has to match with, pay with the PayPal information. And we were just like, um, but we did double check with you beforehand that we could do this. And they were like, no, no, like you have to cancel the order and pay for it again with the correct address. And then we were like trying to make them pay, like... I guess the full order amount of this order again, and then they would refund the original payment. It's like, no. And then after trying for like a week to get something through and like canceling all payments and like paying with my own PayPal and everything, they were like, finally, like, we give up. We will make an exception for you this one time and send it for you. And I was like, fucking finally. It's like, let's just. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, so first up we had the child M and V outfit here. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it's also so like some of the items you already saw in Emmy's video because we got doubles, like me and Alexandra, our friend, got some of the same items. Oh my god. So this is basically a three piece outfit with some stockings as well. So this peplum top here is separate with this top and a skirt. Oh, this is so soft. You cannot even imagine. It's amazing. And then these thigh high socks. It's amazing because I was extremely smart. And when I was packing clothes to take for Remy to Germany, I actually took MSD sized stockings. And I only realized the other day when I was gonna dress her in black stockings and they only fit her up to her thighs. So that was funny. <gasps> Love for it. Love for it, it's so cute. Oh my god. So this is, um, wow, it's so big. I was a bit jealous of Emmy when she got her her jacket, which is a different store, and they had a bag with it. And I, we had like all been debating like which jackets we should be getting, and I decided on this one because I love like just everything. It's so soft. So like I love this jacket, but I wish I had gotten a free bag too. Oh, this is so cute. So it's like this, super fluffy. Really is gonna look so pretty in it. Alright, there's something here that they repackaged. So we didn't realize to begin with that like, there's an option for them opening up the packages and not opening up the packages. And I prefer original packaging, so I was a bit sad when I realized. Oh, here's the Lafric dress as well. Let's just throw this. This is the one with chains. Oh, chains are actually grey. I, I really thought I got the white dress. Like, sometimes my memory is so horrible. Like, I like a lot of items and then my mind 
I decide to do one thing, but then my mind decides something completely different for me. Oh, it's so cute. Super nice fabric too. Like the many things down here. It's gonna be so cute with a jacket. See what's next? Oh, this is from MVS. It's like a um, those scarf tops. Let's see if I will actually know how to tie this on her. <laughs> anyway, like this is cute because I could use it for her hair or whatever as well. I actually found this person selling some scarves second hand and I was like, thanks. Accidentally paid with it. Fell on the floor and accidentally paid for it. Yeah, the, the DHL guy that comes here with my stuff, it's like the second time he has brought me stuff that I have to pay up the customs for. He doesn't learn from his mistakes and doesn't bring chains. Last time he had to go back and like find chains or like his friend who was like going to source to deliveries with him. This time he just didn't have chains and he's like, sorry, I don't have any chains. So you cannot get your 50 cents back. Stupid, but okay. This is also MNW Studio. Ooh, this one Emmy already unpacked in previous video. More socks. Oh, I think these are so pretty. They have this like silvery shimmer in them. Ooh, I think it's looking really good on camera. And there's the top. You can tie this like ribbon. I guess it's already tied. So it's the ribbon here, it goes behind the neck like cute soft cardigan style and skirts oh my god the skirts mm, the sailor is white that's kind of disappointing really stands out but yeah look. there's the slit here and it has this like super cute detail here it's maybe like more cutesy in a way because of the ribbon detail and everything that what I generally speaking dress Remy in, but it's too cute, so she was trying new things. So she will be happy to have something cutesy. Oh, um, so I got a present from Tata's Paradise. I bought this like just the tiniest, I guess. Oh, I guess it's just the one. Oh, maybe I misremember. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the one hairpin. I mean, I guess I don't need more. <laughs> and then like these tiny little things. Those should have gone to Amy. Maybe she can use it for something. I cannot. I mean, it's super cute. It's like bunny little logo. So cute. Put that back in here. I didn't have nearly as many items as Emmy because it was only for, more, for our friends as well. But I have a like, it should be around 26. Oops. Oh, that's hilarious. Okay, this store is a wig. I don't remember the name of the store. Um, do they say here? No, they have a, a Fei Fei is the store ID. And they sent like a thank you card. And at the back, they have the um, fake zipper thingies, fabric zipper thingies. Me and Amy looked for them everywhere in Iceland. All the stores sell those kinds of zippers. Only sell like in like two meters or something. And they were like, 10 euros maybe or something, they were really expensive, so we really didn't want to buy that. So I finally found some in Germany and bought them last month. But okay, thank you. I guess that's very convenient to get. And I love this color. Okay, Amy was absolutely correct when she was talking about how soft these wigs are. Oh my God. It is so, so just amazingly soft. It's it's unreal. So it's like a, a purple color, but it, it has like 
highlights, lowlights. I never know what it is called really. Oh, the shine isn't looking so great on it and because of my ring light. But you'll have to see photos. Oh, it's, it's just like, look how my fingers just glide through. Well, this one has like fringe. Yeah, and we already unboxed like the other color, the peach, I think you got. This is so soft. Oh, we have this small one. I've already lost my shit over this wig for too long. It's so pretty. Another wig. Yeah, Amy mentioned it in a video, sorry, like, we kind of, like, always seem to think the same things when we start thinking about things. So, we both started, like, kind of losing our shit over darker wigs. We had never really bought a lot of them. Oh my god, this is so pretty. So, I think we had also two of this one. So, Amy already unpacked one. Like, I love the hairlines on these two. It's... I don't know how it's gonna look on Remy, but it looks really natural like this. Oh, it's such a pretty color too. Oh. And like up here, the hairline, it's... These are just like almost as good quality as just humans would wear. These are amazing. And again, so soft. Yeah, I'll try to include where we got this store, these bags as well because i forget the name at the moment there were a few like kaka world and some stores that we were getting from but i really don't remember which is which okay here's love freak yeah it's from it's the white shirt dress it was like a, i guess like a unisex shirt so like for um larger male dolls they were just like a shirt I mean, I guess you could use those shirts with pants as well. And then for the women or female dolls or whatever, they kind of could work as a dress. So it's like a sheer one. It's so pretty. And this one here, you can tie as a ribbon here. Oh, it's so pretty. It has a few buttons here at the middle. So it's so cute. Kind of a puffy shoulder thing going on. Oh, so cute. And here also has similar buttons. It's so cute. Me and Emmy have major FOMO, so like we bought a lot from last week. And then, like, I was always going back and looking, like, oh. They still have that. Oh, yeah. Well, should I have bought that too? And like this one top that Amy bought. When she was like showing me photos, I was like, FOMO. And I had to go and check if it was still available, but it wasn't. So, a bit sad, but. Here is the dress that Amy got in the um, house too. It's really strong blue on it. And I got it in the Hound color, and I got it in pink. Yes. Oh, so cute. That is so cute. Buttons here on the front. They're more silver. They kind of look goldish in the camera, I feel like, but they're kind of they're silver. Silver and white. You never have enough jackets. This one is so cute. I really wanted to get a jacket for them. We only had like these kind of like cardigans for cardigan ones and like one kind of fluffy, but and definitely the best I can use is something else too. This fabric is so nice, it's kind of silky. Wow. And these are real pockets. Seriously, what the fuck? And it's like double lined as well, so it has an... I don't know exactly what it's called. Either way, like you can't see the pockets from this side because it has a lining. And the same, the white one is on the pink side as well. Oh, that is so cute. That's, I, I just love that they have pockets. I didn't think 
they would have real pockets, but just like look at this. Here. Oh my god, that's great. That's great. So yeah, Emmy is actually coming to Germany next week is. So I'm looking forward to taking some doll photos together. And maybe we'll do I think we're gonna do like a new introduction movie for our channel because the one that's like up is like ooh very old and like we had like super dark hair and everything so yeah we have these pants they are not as distressed as they were in the photo so maybe i will google how you're supposed to distress pants because this is just like oh the back rip. so this is basically just just throw that away they cut holes in here and just left it at that. But I really hold I uh, more pockets. More pockets. I really hope Rumi will look cute in these because on photos these look amazing. <gasps> this is what I have been looking forward to one of the most. So I have been planning to take photos of her of Rumi in a yukata with all the cherry blossoms because the cherry blossoms here are like a specific one called Yai Sakura. I don't know if they have a name in English. And they have much a lot more flowers on one bud or like the petals, petals. But they bloomed earlier this year than they did last year, so I had to just suck it up and take normal photos. She was super cute. Though. This is so cute. Okay, let's look at what we got. Oh, we got some ties with it. So I guess I got presents. Cute little ties. Maybe I can use that with some of the wigs. Let me just put this here for now. Okay, let's start with the yukata. Oh, it looks, it feels so big like this. Like the sleeves and everything feel so big. Hopefully the size is gonna be fine for her. Um, wow, I, I just love the fact that it has butterflies. I'm not the biggest fan of butterflies in real life. I don't want them too close to me, but I still do think they're really pretty. And this one is really pretty. They had it in like the reverse colors. So like it was blue instead of white and the butterflies were white, but yeah, this is so pretty. I might actually like iron it a bit before I dress her in it, but let's see. Wow. For some reason it's like double layered here, maybe. I don't know why. But, oh my God, it's so pretty. Look at this. I can't wait to dress her up in this. I've only ever dressed myself in a yukata so it's gonna be a challenge to see how it's gonna be to dress a doll in it too so moving on we have oh there is a ribbon a lace in here but it's sewn in such a way that i don't know if it's gonna be visible maybe i can pull it up like so so it's gonna be like this kind of detail but yeah, the opi is what's called tsukuri opi. So usually when you buy your kata, you can you just get the whole opi and you tie it yourself. But you can also get when the ribbon itself is kind of just stuck down into this kind of a circle, and it's called tsukuri opi. It's it kind of just means like pre-made opi or something. So I mean it's cute, but I always preferred tying my own but I knew what I was getting and then just like two of these kind of to tie around the obvious decoration I mean it's not gonna look pretty like this but I I'm very much looking forward to styling it and seeing how I can do it and maybe I can I have a lot of pearl cotton I could make something to tie around okay that's something to look at this is like something i was a bit afraid i would have trouble getting 
but I googled and supposedly Germany doesn't have too strict laws about counterfeits and I guess especially if it's just like a miniature they might not care I don't know, maybe maybe some people do care about these things I don't know, it's just for dolls I don't think they sell stuff for dolls so I am not stealing business from them I don't know but I love bags for dolls. It's like one of my favorite things. Let's just look at this. Let's see how it opens up. It has like a proper magnet. So there's like a small filling in here. Let's take that out. Look at this. Oh my god. It's so well done. Only thing is, I don't like this lot, this thing here. I don't know if I can change that somehow. Maybe I can. I need pliers or something, but I should be able to just take this one off. But this is so cute. I'm in love. And there's blue in it, so it kind of goes with you, Kada. Let's see what we have here. Oh, I bought this tiny bit of fabric, <laughs> because why not? This is like a cute pink one. I want to make some bad things for bloody dolls, so it's gonna be good for that. Ooh, but here's like pants that actually our friend got as well, so Amy already opened this one. But I got the beige because I think Rumi is gonna look amazing in these beige pants. I love that this store gives you small little hangers with the items, like, I wish everyone would do that. Again, they have pockets. Look at this. So it has like these small like sews in here to give it a bit of character and more pockets. And I love that it, it has these here thingies that I don't know what it's called really. So it can, I can use a belt. <sighs> that is so cute. They have actually like this store called Sister and Granny, if you guys know it. Oh, and this is, yeah, really easy to open. <laughs> and they have this like, um, pleather thing, I guess, like super miniature one, which I, I could use it to make a belt. And they have it in brown and black, so it would be cute with this. Tiny hanger. I want to hang it up somewhere. I can hang it up here. <gasps> yeah, I have like a garland here with photos, but that's fine. Okay. And a belt. It's a bit more pink than I guess it showed on the photo. This one is from the same store as these pants. So that was like the main thing. And it goes together like this. It's super cute. And it's super shiny, sparkly here. So, yeah, this is like kind of like a braid belt thingy. Yeah, I actually really like this. And like, has a buckle here. That is so cute. It has a proper buckle and everything. Yeah. And that's that. Continuing on with my fake things. Now it's Louis Vuitton. Don't call for me how I say that because I don't know how to pronounce it correctly. So yeah, Alexander got this one in the dark brown, black, whichever, whatever it's called. And I got it in just brown. But Superbuy insisted on sending these things separately for them. Maybe FedEx doesn't take these kinds of items, I don't know. There was no problem with having, with me having this at, oh my god. Even like this thing here, which I honestly want to get rid of because why, has the LV sign on here. <laughs> I love this kind of attention to detail, it's so pointless, but it's so cute. Let me see how I can, yeah, I will have to somehow adjust it a bit, but oh my god, look how cute that is. Let me just open up. 
boxes. Woohoo! It's so cute. Remy is gonna look so cute with all her new things. Oh yeah, and then this top here is from the same store as... I'm horrible, why am I forgetting all the names of these stores? I've been looking at them for so long, but I just cannot remember. This one is from the same as the white pants and the pink belt. So it's this kind of like, kind of off the shoulder top, tie this kind of like a ribbon in the front. I like this, even though it's like mostly dots. Oops, sorry. It's like... I'm not mostly that, it's just dots, but it kind of like, because I guess the dots, somehow it makes me think of Dalmatian pattern. Like, the dots in this do not bother me. I don't like things with dots. Like, Amy saw so many dresses, she was like, oh my god, this is so cute, and I would like look into it. I was like, but it's like dots, so I don't want it. <laughs> and then I like, I buy this make it make sense and i guess i got like a small present let's see is it i'm not sure if it's like a i guess it's supposed to be a necklace maybe i can make it into a belt i really don't like stars to be honest but i can definitely use this chain for something yeah i don't know i find stars to be kind of childish and I don't know. I've just never been a big fan of them. Let's put it in the Louis Vuitton bag so it doesn't get lost. Cash. And what? Ah! So, this thing I waited on forever. It, I think it took them like almost a month to finally ship it out. I don't know if it's because it's handmade and it just takes them forever. I honestly cannot say. But this is the, um, I bought the hair accessory to go with the yukata. And so. Okay, it's nothing. So it's like this. Let me see. It's super pretty. My only thing is that this, um, I forget what this thing is called, this one thing here, I'm used to fasten it in the hair. It's kind of big and it stands out here. So you see here I'm promise kind of the distance up there. So like it kind of stands out. I'm not the biggest fan of that, but I guess in photos I can make it so it's not visible. But it's so cute. Let's see if I mean I don't know if it will look super good with the uh, yukata because eh, it's fine. We'll make it work. So yeah, this store is called Crow Doll Studio. And Amy got this cute like cat ear thingies from them. Like they gave me a present, I guess, because I had to wait a long time. But it's not something I use and Amy asked if she could just get it so I was like yeah okay okay are these the eyes oh yeah these are eyes Jiaoba 98 I guess is the name of the store oh this this is like hard this thing so pretty see see they're like brown. They're like this tiny pupil because Emmy was wanting to try that. I'm not sure if that's something I'm super interested in personally, but they are super pretty. Like so. Let me see. Oh, kind of opening. Having an. Oh. It's too exposed. Over exposed. So. You will see it on our Instagram. We're nearing the end. Oh, this is something that we already have in Iceland, but um, I have been kind of playing with the idea of making more holes in Rumi's ears. Like she has to like normal, just like you know. But 
I don't remember what this is called but it's kind of piercing here on this guy I've always wanted it myself and I think correct me if I'm wrong that I should be able to do that to Remy so I got a hand drill to drill her ears yeah and they even have like a few sizes I obviously do not need the big ones but I guess the second number two size would be perfect uh, one of them kind of moved around yeah second or third would be perfect so that's gonna be fun Ooh, and I am sending Rumi away from a new face up soon, so that's something to look forward to. Here's my Gedas for the um for the yukata. I got brown ones, like wooden, so pretty. So I kind of like just got the idea one day, like oh yukata, I have to add that to the order. And the first yukata that I saw, I fell in love with. I tried to look around just in case because I didn't want to just like be like, oh, I'm just gonna get the first thing I see. But then I didn't see anything else that I wanted. And the same happened with the get that I just like looked for get that, and that was like the first I saw, and I was like, oh my god, what's this? Again, so much strong. That is not gonna happen. Maybe I'm just be smart and use my glasses. Yes, I mean scissors. I mean, I obviously don't have get the feet for, for Rumi, but I of course have her. This is so. I have her um, normal feet with me as well. And oh my god, look how pretty this is. It's like red, like here, and like the level of detail. The thing that holds the thread here is the tiniest little flower. Uh, uh, yeah. I think you can see it like this. Hopefully the quality will be okay and you can see it. I had to fo um, film this with my phone today because um, for some reason my camera and I have never really filmed many videos with my camera so I really don't know what's wrong. It only films um, those like slow motion videos or stop motion or something. So like even if I just press the record button like normally and I see no setting that I did anything weird, it just suits everything slow motion. And <laughs> then I ended up spending like an hour just cleaning out my phone so I would have enough space to film this. But I guess I needed to clean out my phone at some point because I had 20,000 photos. And these are my shoes. I mean, really shoes. Let's be smart. This has a lot of glue. So, I think Amy, I don't know how well Amy showed these shoes that our friend got. This is Libre Studio and oh my god, the packaging is so pretty. So... Yeah, yeah, I remember not to show them, but I got them in brown. Oh, they're really soft. Look how pretty that is. The, um, so yeah, functional zipper, decorative, decorative zipper. Oh my god, it's so pretty. I would be very sad if Rumi cannot stand in them. I have these one shoes from Kalidol that she stands in perfectly. Like. You would not believe how amazing these shoes are just for her standing capabilities but yeah we're almost done this is mvs i remember mvs always and yeah because i really like them green tube top this is gonna be super cute with the white pants and even the beige ones too um then there's the last one maybe this has my hair styling product. I guess I saved the best for the last or at least the most interesting one because I didn't know people would buy like wig styling things for dolls and 
until I came back to the hobby this year. There's a very strong smell of some of the... Okay, this is like the worst part, it's like it's all in Chinese, so I don't know what it is. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll find out. Google's a thing. Oh. Wait, I'm just gonna take it out of the bag and then I will show you what I got. Oh, these are a bit larger than I thought. I didn't know it was so big. Um, okay. Little straightener. I mean, I could maybe use this for myself. I do not know. I don't have a hair straightener for myself, but I have a hair straightener for my dolls. And I'm, I'm, I have a love-hate relationship with um, poison green or mint green or whatever you want to call this color. So this is a tiny bit disappointing and it looks kind it looks really dirty to be honest but tiny little hair straightener hopefully this one works well and i should have a uh, adapter for this hopefully it's gonna be fine completely forgot to think about that that was very smart but most of my appliances i bought with me from japan so i have plenty of adapters and then it's like a curling iron. Ooh. I like this one, it's really pretty pink. Look how thin that is. That's gonna be fun to try. So cute. Kind of salmon is pink. Nice. Okay, I at least have plenty of better work now to use. Then I got these things. Um, I guess these kind of curly ones to have pulled the curls. Um, I maybe this is to protect your fingers. I am completely going. Maybe, I think. Let's say that. Or is for these things to. I honestly will have to go for it because I'm a bit confused. I didn't know I was getting this either. Then I just got these combs and there's like a super tiny one here. That's cute. And some mist thingy. This is shine spray. Nice. And then I guess this is like a um, gel is kind of thing to control the hair. Just hair clips to hold it away. I think this is a mistake. No, it is different scissors, but I got two really proper looking scissors. I don't know if they're gonna be good, but I mean, these are like, I guess those um, thin, thin out the hair. Yeah, interesting. So yeah, that's gonna be fun. So that was everything that I got, but I also wanted to show you guys I don't know if anyone watches this, um, follows, on, follows us on Instagram, which is uh, ours, ours Doll Atelier. But we post like our like mini gats on their like box openings. But I wanted to show things that we got recently. Amy bought these actually from Korea. There's like a few items you got from Korea. This one, it's DK Craft Shop. They have two. Um, accounts on Instagram actually I don't know why one of them is just DK craft shop but the other one is DK craft shop doll but these pants have like the slit here they have pockets too and they're extremely cute they really look so good in them um, and then this one too is from DK craft shop this one is extremely so um, soft and has the you have to def we have to I have to take her head off every time of course because no zipper or anything but yeah that's fine then this one is actually from Tha Thai I think Thai I think I'm saying I, th I think I'm remembering correctly that the store is from Thai Thailand 
I always forget the, how you're supposed to say it in English. I say Thailand and Iceland there. Maybe I'm being wrong. Either way, it's called Honey... Honey something. Sorry, I don't remember. It's super cute though. You can see it on our Instagram. And then Rumi is over here wearing another outfit that we got from TK Craft Shop. Let me just... So it's this set up here, jacket and skirt, and these super cute socks. And she's looking so cute. Let me see. Let's put it away. And yeah. So that is all. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope you enjoyed. I Hope you found some things that you like and might you want to get yourself. Because we love just enabling everyone in their shopping addictions. Because this is a shopping addiction for sure. So yeah, let's not drag this on for too long. Thank you so much for watching. Please comment, like and maybe even subscribe if you haven't yet. Or just look at our Instagram because we are definitely way more active there so bye me thanks for watching